Nah, fix it in post. That is not a thing we can fix in post. Yeah, fix it in post. <laughs> hey, bud, how's it going? If you're new to the channel, then welcome. Take a seat. And if you're coming back later, cat may be out of the bag. But that doesn't mean it's alive. Welcome back to another movie commentary. My name is Sam. Steph. And we're the movie buds. Inside Out. We've both seen this. It's a really fun movie. I enjoyed it a lot. I only saw it the one time in cinemas, but I do remember being a bit underwhelmed by it. Oh, really? It's a complicated subject. It's very complicated. It does require a certain amount of nuance, I think. that They handle the subtleties quite well from what I remember, and yeah, it's a difficult story to tell. Oh, definitely. One thing I do really like about this movie is that uh, I heard afterwards that a similar method gets used now to teach children in therapy. Mm. It's definitely a step forward. You know, I'm not ragging on the movie or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I do remember the music was really nice on this one. Fair enough. That I do remember. That's always good, but this one was a standout for me. Sure. Do you ever look at someone and wonder what is going on inside their head? Frequently, yes. Yes, all the time. Well, I know. I, I know Riley's head. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're starting right at the start? Right at the beginning. Mm hmm. Little potato. <laughs> Oh, sweet. So yeah, like the first emotion she ever experienced was joy. Okay, yep. I mean, you'd hope the first thing you'd think is joy. Yeah. And there she was, Riley. That disgust rocks up first. Like, oh, these are my parents. <laughs> Yuck. Aren't you a little bundle of joy? Hey, first memory. Aren't you a little bundle of joy? It's a good one. That's a keeper. It was amazing. Riley and me forever. Oh. Oh. For 33 seconds. Yeah. Oh. I'm sadness. Hey, me too. <laughs> I'm joy. If you could. This bitch. Headquarters only got more crowded. Fighting for control. Yeah. Makes sense. Very good. Well, that's right, parent. Ah! That's fear. Ah! He's really good at keeping Riley safe. Yeah, people forget how useful fear can be. Yeah, right? We're good. Thank you very much. And we're back. Oh, no. All right, open. What is it? There is a dangerous smell, people. This is disgust. Keeps Riley from being poisoned. It's broccoli. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> She's got high standards. I just uh, saved our lives. One of the most nutritious things you can eat, but sure. You're not going to get any dessert. Did he just say we couldn't have dessert? That's what he said. All of that on the newspaper. No dessert. That's anger. No dessert. Eat this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Right, right. Here comes an airplane. Rage, rage, fucking rage. Here comes an airplane. Oh, airplane. <laughs> He's excited now. We got an airplane, everybody. <laughs> now, that's all good now. Mm -hmm. Crisis averted. We can go back to the basic joy and sadness. Yeah. And you've met sadness. She... <laughs> I'm not actually sure what she does. <laughs> I've checked. There's no place for her to go, so. <laughs> she checked. <laughs> she tried so hard. These are Riley's memories. Mostly happy, you'll notice. Mm. Lots of good memories. That's great. Yeah. The really important ones are over here. These are called core memories. And the important shit. Each one came from a super important time in Riley's life. When she first scored a goal, amazing. Boom. Nice. Look at that. Fucking accidental goals. To be knocking out people's teeth in no time. <laughs> Just like hockey should be played. Exactly. Just the way God intended. It's like the main thing I know about hockey. Knocking out teeth. Yeah, that's all I know. Each core memory powers a different aspect of Riley's personality. Hockey Island! Mm -hmm. There's no basketball island? Now you guys can all go fuck yourselves. This is a hockey town. <laughs> Goofball Island is my personal favorite. <laughs> Friendship Island is pretty good too. Most of the time, it can be. I love Honesty Island. Oh, Riley, you little shit. Yeah. Family Island is amazing. The islands of personality are what make Riley, Riley. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hey. <laughs> nice. Yeah, you gotta love the floor is love. Classic game. Ah, yep, fucking up the walls. Excellent. Yeah. <laughs> I do appreciate that everyone literally just freezes in that. Yeah. <laughs> what happens when she has a brain fart, though? Ooh. <laughs> Kamikaze! Everybody run! No! Thank you. Good night, Dad. Another perfect day! 
I do love the visual storytelling, like how they just make it all work, like it's an office and stuff, you know? I call that an unqualified success. Mm -hmm. I agree. Yeah. And I like that in this case, Joy is in charge, but I'm pretty sure we find out later on, like different people, different emotions are in charge. Exactly. Different dominant emotions. Things couldn't be better. Riley's 11 now. Yeah, yeah, that shit's gonna change. What could happen? A lot of things could happen. Not what I had in mind. <laughs> All right, so we're moving like interstate, I think. Yeah, uh, San Francisco, if I remember right. Yeah, there's only so many cities in America that movies are set in. Exactly. You're not allowed to set them in any other ones. No, fuck Dakota. <laughs> you know what you did, Dakota. <laughs> <laughs> I sure am glad you told me earthquakes are a myth, Joy. Oh, earthquakes are definitely not a myth. Uh, yeah. Definitely lied about that one. My kind of people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, buddy, you'd love New York. Oh, yeah. Sydney, too. We're almost to our new house. Why don't we just live in this smelly car? We've already been in it forever. Plenty of time to think about what our new house is going to look like. <laughs> Let's review the top five daydreams. That looks uh, safe. No, 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 no. This one. Uh-huh. Yeah, all great options. That's the one. It comes with a dragon. Not so good, but, you know, still. We're getting close. I can feel it. I like that they all chip in. <laughs> oh, oh no. Right. There's only so much you can afford in San Francisco. It was only $3 million, practically a steal. <laughs> <laughs> We're supposed to live here? Can you die from moving? Guys, you're overreacting. I mean, yes, you can die from moving. A dead mouse! Ah! Yeah, if you move, like, off a bridge. We're gonna get rabies! Get off of me! Yeah, or you're carrying, you know, large couch up the stairs, fall, crush yourself, go down the stairs, break your neck. Oh, okay. Dad talked about how cool our new room is. Less literal kind of moving. I'm starting to envy the dead mouse. Riley can't oh. live here. Oh, <laughs> wow. Hey, it's nothing our butterfly curtains couldn't fix. It's funny how your perspective changes as you get older. I'm looking at that room like, hmm. I know, same. I feel like, oh man, am I just a fucking total shop? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, it's so spacious. We'll put the bed there and the desk over there. And let's go get our stuff from the moving van. The moving van? And won't be here until Thursday. Oh, fantastic. That does sound like moving, though. I've been you said it would be That's what they told me. Uh, I've got a great idea! Anderson makes her move. She's closing in. Yes. Good call. Just Riley, suddenly breaking up the fight with her parents. <laughs> yeah. yeah! <laughs> hey, and the paper's in the fireplace. Perfect start. You can light a fire. Yeah, exactly. Burn down the whole apartment. Or house. Grandma. Grandma. Uh-oh, we're in for it. Then claim the insurance. Hey, hey you get it. That's using the <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. The investor's supposed to show up on Thursday, not today. I think the dad just got the days mixed up. Mm -hmm, maybe. He said the movers are on Thursday and the investors, you know, are coming today. They were meant to come on Thursday. It sounds like he just got the date switched. Yeah, see, you say that, but uh, you've moved house twice? No, no. A lot of times, actually, in the past. Okay. I'm aware that things can get mixed up, but I'm just saying in the case of the movie, I wouldn't be surprised if it was like just a little tidbit that they threw in there. It's like, oh, actually, yeah, he just mixed up the days. It's possible, but having moved probably like a hundred times in my life, I'm going to say it never goes how you want it to. Dad just left us. Oh, he doesn't love us anymore. I should drive, right? You know what I've realized? Riley hasn't had lunch. Yes. Yeast of Eden. I saw a pizza place down the street. Pizza sounds delicious. Yeah. I mean, when does pizza not sound delicious? What the heck is that? This time, apparently. Oh, okay, no, what? Congratulations, San Francisco. You've ruined pizza. I agree with you, Angle. I love broccoli, but not on pizza. But also, though, like, there's a menu. Why would you ask for that? Good question. That diner in Nebraska? The spoon stood up in the soup by itself. Ooh, thick soup. Drive out was pretty fun. What was your favorite part? Fitting out the car window. Wearing a seatbelt. <laughs> <laughs> Wearing a seatbelt. That's just fantastic. Couldn't get any better than that. I like that they didn't make fear the bad guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yes. just look behind you. Oh, I like that time with the dinosaur. Oh. Oh, they're becoming sad. That's right. Wait, what? What happened? Hey, stop it. She did something to the memory. I just touched it. Can't change it back? No, I guess I can't. Now when Riley thinks of that moment with Dad, she's gonna feel sad. God, if you were Joy, you would just be so done. Mm. We've got a stairway coming up. Just don't touch any other memories until we figure out what's going on. This is a monster railing. We are riding it all the way down. Do not fall off and break your neck. Yeah, no. Don't get me wrong. I've done a lot of rail sliding myself, so not one to judge. That's part of the thrill. Wait, what? What happened? Uh, uh, a core memory! Oh, no! Um, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You look like one was crooked, then it fell out! There we go. All right. Cool. Sliders. 
I wanted to maybe hold. Stop. Stop it. Yeah, actually. What are you doing? You nearly touched a core memory. We can't change them back. I'm sorry. Something's wrong with me. I, I do like how they get that across, though, that it's like you move and suddenly all the happy memories you have of that place become sad because you're far away from them now. Absolutely. It's stress. I'm awful. No, you're not. I'm annoying. They will. This bitch. You can't focus on what's going wrong. Find the fun. I don't know how to do that. Sadness is not capable of finding the fun. <laughs> She's not supposed to be either. Exactly. Try to think of something funny. Remember the funny movie where the dog dies? <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. Jesus. What about that time when Riley laughed so hard milk came out of her nose? That shit is funny. That hurt. It felt like fire. It doesn't hurt a lot. A little bit. What are your favorite things to do? Well, I like it when we're outside. Good! Like that time we buried Dad in the sand up to his neck? And then we tried to strangle him while he was down there. We tried to leave him. Forever. <laughs> you never make us eat broccoli again. Well, I was thinking more like rain. We can stomp around in puddles. More like when the rain runs down our back and makes our shoes soggy. Her name is Sadness. Yeah. Starts feeling droopy. Oh, hey, hey. Why are you crying? That's what she does. Yeah, I know, right? 11 years of this and you still haven't learned? How about we read some mind manuals? Long-term memory retrieval volume 47? Long-term memory data selection via channel sub Groupie. Super fun. Sounds like a fucking riveting time. Love it. <sighs> yeah. Hey, get analytical. That's my jam. Get analytical. Let it go. We've only got capital to last a month. Come kiss me goodnight. I know. Be I right know. there. Yep. Yeah, just breaking up the drama. Did you hear dad? He's he sounded really upset. Get ready for a family trauma island. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <gasps> Was it a bear? There are no bears in San Francisco. I saw a really hairy guy. Well, oh. I mean, there are some bears in San Francisco. <laughs> I just got that joke. <laughs> Let's make a list of all the things Riley should be happy about. Our room stinks. Pizza is weird here. Our friends are back home. Yeah. It could be worse. Yeah, Joy. It could be lying on the dirty floor in a bag. Oh, Oof. sleeping on the floor. Gotta love that one. Good times. Definitely hurts the hips. Especially when you're skinny, because you've got nothing between the bone and the floor. There's absolutely no reason for Riley to be happy right now. We should lock the door and scream that curse word we know. <laughs> we all have our off days. The mom bad news train is pulling in. <laughs> Why do you sound jazzed about this? Still not moving, Dan. Won't be here till Tuesday. Do, do, do. He loves it when there's shit to be angry about, so. Now, for a few well-placed withering scouts. <laughs> <laughs> he is an awesome. Teeth. Thank you. Huh? You've stayed our happy girl. Yeah, damn right. Your dad's under a lot of pressure. If you and I can keep smiling, it would be a big help. We can try. I get that it's good to try to stay positive in bad situations, you know? Sure. But I like how they're already doing a really good job of setting up the seeds of Riley being the one who kind of holds everything together in a sense. Mm. You know, she's always staying happy. She's always staying positive. When her parents start to fight, she kind of tries to interject and keep them from fighting each other. Yeah, the nuance, man. That's what I was saying, eh? What did we do to deserve you? Well, you can't argue with mom. Team happy. Sounds great. Totally behind you, Joy. I love that everyone's behind it. Yep. Looks like we're going in R.E.M. Yeah. R.E.M. is coming to ruin your day. End of the world. What's on tonight, Dream Production? Dream Production. Oh, this is it. A new place? Yeah, this is not going to go well. Oh, no. Of course. Somebody order a broccoli pizza? Yeah, that's the wrong kind of bear. Who is in charge of programming down there? She doesn't know any better. She's using her imagination. I appreciate it. Spilling in the gaps. I know I'm not supposed to do this, but we are not going to end the day like this. Yeah, good times. Joy saves it once again. I've always enjoyed ice skating, even though I'm bad at it and it hurts me. I love ice skating, but it doesn't love me. <laughs> I'm going to make sure that tomorrow is another great day. <laughs> you have to play that. Well, I have to practice. Yeah, that would be still super fucking annoying. Mm -hmm. Fear. I need a list of all the possible negative outcomes on the first day at a new school. <sighs> Does anyone know how to spell meteor? He's on top of it. That's great. Make sure Riley stands out today, but also blends in. The other kids will look at their own outfits and barf. Fair enough. That's my daily goal. <laughs> <laughs> Joy. Yes, Joy. You'll be in charge of the console. And may I add, I love your dress. It's adorable. Thank you so much. I love the way it twirls. <laughs> Train of thought. Right on schedule. <laughs> Anger. Unload the daydreams. Might come in handy if this new school is full of boring, useless classes, which it probably will be. It's school. Of course it is. It's an American school system, so... I have a super important job just for you. This is the circle of sadness. Make sure that all the sadness stays inside of it. Just stand here? Yes. It's not my place to tell you how to do your job. Except that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> You're a pro at this! See this? See this sadness? This is your lane. Fucking stay in it, yeah? 
new friends, huh? I know. I'm kind of nervous, but I'm mostly excited. You want us to walk with you? No, thank you. Um, no, I'm on it. Nope, I'm fine. Should an 11 year old be walking through a city on her own? I mean, I know that that happens a lot, but is it a good idea? I know. I, like, wasn't allowed to go to school by myself till I was in high school. Whoa, is she wearing eyeshadow? Yeah, we want to be friends with them. <laughs> Let's go talk to them. We're not talking to them. We want them to like us. <laughs> Almost finished with a potential disaster. Spontaneous combustion getting called on by the teacher. We have a new student in class today. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. This is not happening. <laughs> Would you like to tell us something about yourself? No! Not at all. Pretend we can't speak English. <laughs> I'm from Minnesota. How about Minnesota? You certainly get a lot more snow than we do. <laughs> <laughs> the weather. Hilarious. The lake freeze is over. That's when we play hockey. I'm on a great team. My friend Meg plays forward. Luckily, I do believe she can still play hockey in San Francisco. So yes. Ice rinks and whatnot. Kind of a family tradition. We go out on the lake almost every weekend. Not quite the same. There it is. We did, till I moved away. Sadness! What's going on? We used to play tag and... Oh. Cool kids was spring at 3 o'clock. Oh no! They're judging us! Uh... I do like how they actually just look more concerned. Yeah. It's just her perception that they're judging her. Oh, absolutely. I mean... We're crying at school! Many times that is the case. It's just your perception of what you think people think of you, which is not always correct. In fact, frequently incorrect. Oh! 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 It's a core memory. It's blue. Shit. No. no! These things happen. They do. That's a core memory! Stop it! You mean core memory over my dead body? Yeah. <laughs> we will purge this from her mind. Uh. Oh boy. Oh shit. She just gets instant amnesia. Oh, stop trying to help. What are you doing? Fuck. Oh, okay. Oh god. Uh. Well, you're fucked now. Good one, guys. She just feels nothing. Yeah. I know it can be tough moving to a new place. Shit. But we are happy to have you here. I really do appreciate the way that they kind of depict depression. Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily always feeling sad. A lot of it is just feeling fucking nothing. Absolutely. <laughs> Wait, good luck finding them. Do, yeah, okay. Oh, wait, another brighter. Okay. And now she's touching everything. Where are we? Long term memory. Goofball Island? Dear. They're all down. We can fix this. Yeah, it's not great. We just have to get back to headquarters, plug the core memories in. Riley will be back to normal. Uh, not necessarily normal, but y you can adapt. You can yeah, exactly. walk on it. Riley has no core memories. You're not in headquarters. Without you, Riley can't be happy. Well, she also needs to feel sad about stuff. Yeah, sadness is a valid emotion that is useful. It is a necessary you know? emotion. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Because like without sadness, you know, you don't feel remorse, right? Also, just you need to be able to recognize when shit is not okay. All the islands are down. We just do what Joy would do. How are we supposed to be happy? I found a junior hockey league. Mm -hmm. You you pretend to be Joy. Try hard. You can do it. That sounds fantastic. Nope, didn't work out. That wasn't anything like Joy. Because I'm not Joy? Yeah. yeah. Did you guys pick up on that? Ah, uh, yeah, here we go. Uh-huh. Let's probe, but keep it subtle. I like how the designs are pretty much identical. They just got the hair. <laughs> yeah. How was the first day of school? You pretend to be Joy. What? Fine, I guess. Very smooth. <laughs> that was a touch better. Something is definitely going on. But we'll need support. Signal the husband. Oh god, this is so funny. I remember this now. Yeah. Open the night. <laughs> 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 Jackass. Uh-oh, she's looking at it. That's what matters. Yeah. What did she say? Sorry, sir. No one was listening. <laughs> uh, we left the toilet seat up. <laughs> what is it, woman? What? <laughs> He's making that stupid face again. <laughs> Signal him again. Yeah, you notice sadness is in charge in her brain, anger is, is in charge in his. Absolutely. That's what being an adult is. That's not how I roll, but sure. <laughs> Riley, how was school? Are you kidding just... me? We gave up that Brazilian helicopter pilot? I'll be joy. <sighs> she just rolled her eyes at us. Oh boy. Make a show of force. I don't want to have to put the foot down. Not the foot. Hang on a second. Is anger my primary emotion? I think mine is either anger or sadness. I do not like this new attitude. I'll show you attitude. Stay happy! <laughs> Leave me alone. Take it to DEFCON 2. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. When your kid is being emotionally vulnerable, that's when you need to, like, you know, show them who's boss, of course. I don't know where this disrespectful attitude came from. Yeah, that's the perfect time. That'll definitely make her open up to you. You want a piece of this, Pops? Here it comes. <laughs> Prepare the foot. The foot. Jesus the foot is coming down. Ready to launch on your command, sir. <laughs> that's it. Go to your room. Oh, no. The foot is down. Yeah, not well handled, but I mean, they're under stress. That could have been a disaster. Well, that was a disaster. Yeah, but like, for Christ's sake, man, just a little bit of perception. Gum. 
Fly with me, Gachinya. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna walk out there and that? Yes, that's the plan. It's the quickest way back. Right over the memory dump. If we fall, we'll be forgotten forever. Just follow my footsteps. Joy just pushes her in on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can kill two birds with one stone this way. <laughs> oh! Fatality. Things got a little out of hand downstairs. You want to talk about it? Not really. No, nah, dude. Where's my happy girl? Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> Trying to start up goofball. It's a good effort. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, that island is not lit up. Not the time, dude. Oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> so unfortunately, she doesn't have anything to carry those balls with. <laughs> oh god damn, oh god damn. <laughs> you could say that she needs a ball sack. <laughs> Carry those hefty balls around. I know the feeling. <laughs> oh god, the goofball is fucking gone. Yeah, I'm guessing it can be rebuilt, potentially. Or replaced with something new. Yeah, I mean, I actually don't remember how this concludes. I, so. I saw this when it came out in cinema, and that's it, so you know. You need some alone time. And we'll talk later. Moving is a big deal for kids. Yeah, I did it like well, maybe 10 times when I was a kid at least. That means she can lose friendship and hockey and family. <sighs> Riley's gone to sleep. Oh. Nothing else bad can happen while she's asleep. We'll just go across Friendship Island. That looks a bit tough. Never make No, no, don't obsess over the weight of life's problems. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just have to go around. You get yeah. lost in there. Think positive. I'm positive you will get lost in there. <laughs> Long-term memory. Endless warrant of Carter. Read about it in the mail. The manuals? Oh, yeah. So you know the way back to headquarters. Kind of. You are my map. So how do their memories work? No idea. Do they have just all of this again in their heads too? Yeah. Show me where we're going. Oh, I'm too sad to walk. Oh, this actually feels kind of nice. <laughs> we'll be back to headquarters before morning. This is working. Nah. This is not working. Getting a little exhausted. Are we getting close? Just another right. On the left. Ah, right. are you sure you know where we're going? She's not sure. No. Because we seem to be walking away from headquarters. Yes, sometimes the path to where you need to go takes you slightly further away than you were expecting. Uh, da, da. If you touch them, they stay sad. Sorry, I, I won't. Yeah. Starting now. Oh my god. <laughs> She's been touching everything. That's great. Well, the whole bottom row. Okay. Mind workers. But Joy, we're almost. I also love how she just let her drag her this whole time. Yep. They're in her phone. Yeah, just forget Excuse all of that, please. I need to find Friendship Island. Just keep Washington, Lincoln, and the Fab one. Forget them. There you go. Yep, fair enough. They got the priorities straight. Those are perfectly good memories. Every cutie pie, Princess Doll. That is critical information. Damn right. <laughs> Bring those back! Nothing comes back from the dump. Yeah. Goodbye, useless memories. Yeah. When Riley doesn't care about a memory, it fades. I feel like these guys in my brain are just a little too overproductive. <laughs> Fair enough. Happens to the best of them. Yeah, except for this bad boy. Triple the song from the gum commercial. <laughs> we send that one up to headquarters for no reason. <laughs> over and over again, like a million times. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Let's watch it again. Triple Classic. I love that explanation so much. So accurate. What do you think? Should we do it? Yeah. <laughs> Here we go! <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, yes, Just fuck you, Riley. <laughs> Do you like it there? Is the bridge cool? What happened with the playoffs? Coach says we might actually go to the finals, and we've got this new girl on the team. She's so cool. Uh, she did not just say that. Meg has a new friend already? Being replaced. I love that the newspapers always say exactly what's happening currently. <laughs> yeah. You can pass the puck to each other like my reading. I got some to read wait, right wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. I gotta go. What? I gotta go. Yeah. Yeah, you would uh you would feel a bit cut. Yeah, especially at eleven. Friendship Island! Oh, yeah, there Friendship goes. Island is crumbling. Mm -hmm. Good news is you can uh build a new one. Yeah, a better one. Stronger, more powerful. <laughs> Hey, those core memories are still important. Yeah. Riley, love that one. Goodbye, friendship. Just have to go the long way. Why not climb over? There's ladders, right? I can see them. I'm ready. There's gotta be a better way. It'd be kind of hard for her to climb, carrying the balls and sadness with her. Yeah, sure. They can't let sadness touch them either. I will take you, but not you. Oh, this guy. Hello! Ah! Wait, hey! That's Richard Kind, I think. The actor, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's just the actual guy <laughs> in her mind. He's <laughs> invaded her subconscious and is stealing her memories. Excuse me? Ah! Yeah, that's what he does. This is just an elaborate disguise. I was looking for, um, diversion! What? So long, sucker! <laughs> Fantastic diversion. Good job. I know you. I get that a lot. I look like a lot of people. No, no, no. Who else do you look like? Everybody. That's what people look like. Bingo! 
wrong. Riley's imaginary friend. Riley loves playing with you. You two are best friends. Can I get those glasses checked now? <laughs> We're trying to get back to headquarters. Headquarters? I'm Joy. This is Sadness. The Joy? The one and only. Well, what the heck you doing out here? You want to answer that, Sadness? Nope. Without you, Riley won't ever be happy. We got to get you back. Follow me. This is just so tragic that her, like, imaginary friend is just homeless in her brain. That does make sense. So dark. Remember your rocket. It runs on song power. Your theme song. Who's your friend who likes to play? Bing bong, bing bong. Yeah, she's a songwriter too. Yeah. What exactly are you supposed to be? I'm mostly cotton candy, but part cat, part elephant, part dolphin. It's in there. Okay, why not? When Riley was three, animals were all the rage. <laughs> The cow goes moo, the horse goes nay. That's all people talked about. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Pretty classic. What are you doing out here? There's not much call for imaginary friends, so, uh... <sighs> Kick to the cub. Yeah, that's probably a good thing in the long term. <laughs> yeah. Don't be sad. When I get back up to headquarters, I'll make sure Riley remembers you. This is the greatest day of my life! Not for him. No, it's terrible for him, but, you know. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> he cries candy. I cried candy. Try the caramel. It's delicious. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. Here, use this. Oh, yeah. Hold on. He's got a bat. Oh, shit. Buddy. How many memories have you been stealing, my guy? Many. Here. Okay. Other random shit, too. It's imaginary. This will make it a lot easier to walk back to headquarters. Hey, she got her ball sack. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking the train of thought. Of course. There is a station in Imagination Land. I know a shortcut. Cool. Good thought. This way. I'm so glad we ran into you. Oh, I did like this bit. Okay. The station is right through here. I don't remember, but it sounds great. I read about this place in the manual. We shouldn't go in there. Why not? It's not safe. This is abstract thought. There we go. I go in here all the time. Yeah, he can go in there. It's a shortcut, you see? D-A-N shortcut. You can if you want to die. Sure. I'm closer to the station. Let's go around. Almost there. I mean, to be fair, in the time that they talked about it, they could have crossed. This is true. Riley needs to be happy. Bing Bong knows what he's doing. He's part dolphin. They're very smart. Not this one. He blew all his money on instant lottery tickets. But he is Bing Bong and you are not. He got the dumb part of the dolphin. But he can be an abstract thought. Yeah, true. They're core primary, you know, emotions. You know what I'm saying? Riley going to therapy years later. So when did she stop? feeling happy. Oh, around about the time my joy turned into an abstract thought. <laughs> what abstract concept are we trying to comprehend today? Loneliness. I'm going to turn it on for a minute and burn out the gunk. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, no, they turned it on. Never seen this before. <laughs> <laughs> my beautiful face. No. Concerning. What is going on? We're abstracting, not objective fragmentation. I do like that. That's clever. Okay, yep. Interesting. Oh! We're in the second stage. We're deconstructing. I can't feel my legs. Oh, there they are. <laughs> Come here, me. We gotta get out of here. Oh. Let's reconstruct. Yeah. We'll get stuck here forever. Oh. It's a shortcut! I mean, I guess it's technically a shortcut if you make it out. Oh. Oh no. Okay. Now they're too deep. We're two dimensional. We're getting nowhere. I'm lacking depth. <laughs> lacking depth. We can't fit. We're not figurative. The last day. Okay. Nah, this, this is pretty great. Yeah. Wait, we're, we're two dimensional. Fall on your face. Very interesting. <laughs> okay. Sure. That works. Uh, you're gonna miss the train. Uh, Stop! Stop! You're too abstract. Well, hey, they're reforming. We should not have gone in there. They really should put up a sign. <laughs> <laughs> There's another station. The train always stops there. This isn't another one of your shortcuts, is it? Yeah! <laughs> Most definitely. Is there really another station? Through there. Welcome to Imagination Land! Sweet. This should be fun. Oh, great. Now I just can't not think of the South Park episode. I know. That was the first thing I thought, too. Trophy Town! Everyone's a winner! Scoring a goal. Yay! <laughs> I won first place! Me too! Participation award. <laughs> <laughs> Sucks to be you. Yep. It's Cloud Town. Oh, it's so soft. Let me try. Hey, <laughs> you better fix that wall or else you're in big trouble. Uh, did Bing Bong just murder that man? I think he did. Woo! Oh! A British sure just killed a man. Yeah, that's murder, my dude. Hey, look, the house of cards. Do not go in there. Yeah, no, don't. Kevin Spacey looks about. You rock it. I stashed it in there, and now I'm all set to take Riley to the moon. Dude, this guy. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Great. Just a trail of destruction everywhere he goes. There's always something new like... Who the heck is that? Imaginary boyfriend. Oh my god. I would die for Riley. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen him before. I live in Canada. Okay, sure. Anyway, this way. We're nearly to the train. I would die for Riley. You know, when she was in Minnesota, the Canada situation would not have been that far away. Yeah, it's just far enough to be dangerous, but not so much that it's too threatening. But also close enough that she could actually be potentially meet them. Hey, you see? Gotta go. Good luck, sweetie. If she tries to use Hockey Island, it's going down. I've recalled every hockey memory I can think of. She's about to play. Hurry. Okay. Why not just put them all in? Uh, I don't know. Uh -huh. We did it, gang. Hey, Hockey Island is technically active. Oh, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> she has forgotten how to play. Shit. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Okay, so that's why you don't put them all in. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. oh, right in the nuts. Does Fear have nuts? Does Fear have a dick? Why does he have a dick? All things considered, I think if any emotion has nuts that you can then crush, it would be Fear. Yeah, it's true. To give him something to be afraid of. That's it! No, 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 free! Ah! Go, Riley. Knock someone's teeth out. Hey, it's a useful emotion in this game. Yeah. What's wrong? Let's go. What's the point? It'll be all right. Stop saying everything will be all right. I mean, it might be. But that is how I've kind of always approached things. Just everything will be okay and, you know, things do work out. At least for me. True, but you do need to also acknowledge the bad stuff too. You know, just to have that sense of realism. Whoever said anything about not acknowledging the bad stuff? Hockey? I feel like the parents are not getting on her level in that sense of acknowledging, hey, look, we know that this is kind of shit for you. They're just being like, yeah, yeah, how was school? It's a new school, my dude. Yes. I moved schools, you know, like for the last two years of primary school, it was hell. Yeah, yeah. You can't necessarily fix it, but yeah, pretending that everything is fine can just come off as really condescending. Well, again, not pretending everything's fine. You're right. Acknowledge the issue and then recognize that things probably will be okay. Measuring up how bad everything really is. Like, okay, is it really that bad? Management strategies. Will you really never make any new friends? You Will, will you really never play hockey again. Very unlikely. She can't give up hockey. We have to get to that station. Sure thing. We'll have to Princess Dream World. Oh no. <laughs> oh my glitter. It's that's the animal hall of fame. Oh, oh wow. Jesus. It's all coming down. My rocket. Oh God. It still has some song parallel. <laughs> and now it's trash. Oh God. He's being evicted. No. They're throwing out what little belongings he has left. Yeah, I mean, that's as close to a home as he's got. <laughs> and now it's gone. Riley can't be done with me. Well, she can, but sorry. That's harsh, but you know. We can fix this. The implications for everybody else's imaginary friends is so dark. <laughs> <laughs> Assuming you had one, which I did not. Yeah, I didn't, but this is just tragic. I had a whole trip planned for us. Hey, Bing Bong, look at this. Mm. Hilarious. Come on, let's go to the train station. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I was talking about. I'm sorry they took your rocket. Mm -hmm. Acknowledgement. Sadness. Don't make him feel worse. Sadness doesn't always make things worse. It's all I had left of Riley. I bet you and Riley had great adventures. Once we flew back in time, we had breakfast twice that day. <laughs> yeah, I don't need to go back in time to have two breakfasts. I'm a grown up. <laughs> we were best friends. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that was the plan all along. It's okay, guys. Just eat candy. I'm okay now. The train station is this way. How did you do that? I'm sad, so I listened to what... Hey! Gotta let it out sometimes. Acknowledgement. Just, you know, you realize it's there, you deal with it, you let it go. There's the train! <laughs> We're finally gonna get home! Dude. Maybe stop knocking shit over them. These facts and opinions look so similar. Oh. Ah, don't worry about it. Happens all the time. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <sighs> I give this day an F. Why don't we quit standing around quitting? <laughs> That's what I'm doing. This coward's gonna survive. Oh my god. Uh, it doesn't look like you're surviving great, but uh, sure. <laughs> oh, that looks painful. Emotions can't quit, genius. So, how did Joy and Sadness leave? I thought we were supposed to be keeping Riley happy. That's exactly how they left. I know. No idea. Aha! Uh -huh. All the good core memories were made in Minnesota. We go back and make more. Genius. Uh you're saying we run away? Yeah, great plan. Perfect logic. I mean, it's just so drastic. Need I remind you of how great things were there? Triple N. Can I ask 
when I got the show. <laughs> Riley was happier in Minnesota. Should we just sleep on this or something? I'm sure jolly times are just around the corner. I mean, they, they absolutely be. could be. Absolutely. That seems pretty likely, honestly. Huh? Riley's gone to sleep. We're all on break. I guess they have conscious thoughts. Mm -hmm. How about we wake her up? How could we possibly? <gasps> I guess there's a way. How about we wake her up? Great idea, Joy. Thanks. Wow. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Totally grossing your ideas. Whoa. This place is huge. I can fly. <laughs> oh, yeah. The old falling dream. I remember that one back in the day. I love the fucking posters. Rainbow Unicorn. She's right there. My friend says you're famous. Sadness. Don't bother Miss Unicorn. <laughs> I loved you in Fairy Dream Adventure Part 7. Fairy Dream Adventure Part 7. I wonder what that means. Oh, well. Let's go in. <laughs> Stop following this guy into mysterious doors. <laughs> Today's memories are in. We've got a lot to work with. The writers have put together a killer script. Still pretty lucky that it was Fia who got Dream Duty. We could scare her. Scare her? She's been through enough already. But Sadness, you may know your way around down here, but I know Riley. We'll excite her awake. That's never happened before. How does that work? It is still a possibility. That never happened to you. No, I've never woken up from joy. Ah, fair enough. I have. Oh, huh, good for you. Hey. Put this on. I don't think that'll work. Add the reality distortion filter. Riley is the camera. <laughs> Before we begin, she is one bad actress. <laughs> Would you like to stand up Camera? yourself? My name is Riley Anderson. That's great. Nice. Her teeth are falling out. That's oh God. Oh, yeah, I'm used to that one. <laughs> Fantastic dream, guys. Let me guess, we have no pants on. She came to school with no pants on. <laughs> Called it. I don't think this happy thing is going to work. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> uh, what's going on? Random bullshit. Gotta love it. That makes sense for a dream. Yeah, that's funny. This isn't working. <laughs> that's concerning. <laughs> Brilliant. Sadness, come back here. Reconnect. Reconnect. Oh, shit. It's just a dream. It's just a dream. Well, she might wake up from fear, so... Call security. Hi, Riley. It's me. Bing bong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Oh, shit. Sadness, you are ruining this dream. You're scaring her. But look, it's working. It is working. That's what people wake up from the most in dreams. Most frequently, it's fear. Stop right there. Put out. Pan away. Hey. What's up? Boo. Pick a plot line. <laughs> I know people in headquarters. Hey, uh, who's got the bag full of memory balls? He does. Ah, I see. There go the core memories. Shit. Yep, okay. I see. That's not good. Oh, God. Where did they throw them? Into a deep, dark pit. What is this place? The subconscious. Oh. It's where they take all the troublemakers. I feel like undesirable things should not be put in your subconscious. I feel like that's how a lot of us develop problems later in life. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't get to call the shots down there, so. It says my hat. It says my hat? That's what I wrote in my hat. What are you talking about? That, you've got my hat. Hey, give me my hat back, asshole. Yeah. Hey, you! You caught us. Get back in there. <laughs> <laughs> Good plan. Brilliant. How are you going to get out? We'll figure it out as we go. Got to be adaptable. It's where they keep Riley's darkest feet. Broccoli. <laughs> broccoli. Okay, seriously, broccoli is not that bad. The stairs to the basement. It really isn't. Even when I was a kid, I never thought it was that bad. I actually like it. And I hate vegetables. You do, that's true. Consistently across the board. Would you walk wider? I'm trying. Candy wrappers. Just been eating his own tears. Yeah, that's, we'll call it normal because they're candy, I guess. What a sad, sad cycle. Bing bong. Oh, wait, he wasn't eating them. Oh, right. I guess that makes sense. It's Jangles. Oh, it's a birthday. Oh, it's a birthday. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Bad memory. Bad memory. Fair enough. I mean, the fear of clowns thing seems to be uh, pretty widespread. I've never been able to relate to it, but I feel sorry for you if you have. Do you have the core memories? All he cared about was the kid. For me, it's because I saw the first It when I was on TV in like 94, and I was like six. Yeah, I've heard a lot about that. You know, six-year-olds probably shouldn't be watching. That. No, but that's like yeah. just a massive thing that so many people have seen the original It when they were like children. So many people in our generation, at least. Yeah, because it was on TV. Let's get to that train. We still have to wake up Riley. Do it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. Hey, what's up, man? Good morning. How you doing? Hey, Sadness, did you hear about the party that we're having? Oh. Isn't it a birthday party? So joy and sadness can feel fear as well. Apparently. Birthday? Cake present. Birthday? 
definitely got their own little headquarters up inside their own brains. Follow us! <laughs> right? Yeah, has to be. It's just a never-ending cycle. Okay, but it's my hand. Oh, I wrote no, that. but this one's my hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, How did shit. they ever keep this guy in? I don't know. <laughs> great, great dream. <laughs> oh shit. Oh no. Oh yeah, that's a nightmare. Who's the birthday girl? Yep, that'll happen. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. And then he went on a murderous rampage, killing thousands. <laughs> Guess who's on their way to headquarters? We are! Yay! 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 <laughs> he did it again! We were naked and there was a dog! It was a dream! We can't even get a good night's sleep anymore. So why'd you leave him in charge? That's a good question. Time to take action. Who's with me? Yeah, let's do it. Ah, great. The old running away as a child. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. She took it. There's no turning back. She's 11 now. She knows everything. Mm -hmm. She'll be fine. How are we going to get to Minnesota from here? Why don't we go down to the elephant lot and run an elephant? Hey, that sounds nice. We're taking the bus. <laughs> I made it like, what, 50 meters up my street before I realized, oh, this is a bad plan. Oh, uh, yeah. No, I didn't even make it out the door. I was like six or something. And I was, you know, giving my mom attitude. I was like, I'm going to run away. She just opened the door and it was like pitch black outside. And she was like, yeah, yeah. go on, go. Go hard. And I was like. I'll go tomorrow, show you. <laughs> Yeah, good times. I still had my pride. Yeah, see, I was about 10 or 11, so same as her. Packed up what things I thought was important. Got about halfway down the street and I was like, wait, where am I going? Shit, I'm lost. <laughs> <laughs> that was embarrassing, but you know, I mean, I was a kid. This was so well thought out. <laughs> How do we get money? Mom's purse. Where was it we saw it last? Dribble them come. No! <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. Yeah, fantastic. Mom and dad got us into this mess. They can pay to get us out. Oh, yes. Yeah. Steal the parents' money. Great plan. You can see everything from up here. Inductive reasoning, deja vu. Language processing, deja vu. <laughs> Critical thinking, deja vu. I appreciate that. That's a solid joke. That was a good idea. Scaring Riley awake. Nice work. She's there for a reason, man. Absolutely. There is a time and place. Wow, is this Riley? She's so big now. She won't fit in my rocket. How are we going to get to the moon? <laughs> that time in the twisty tree, the hockey team showed up having fun and laughing. Great times. Yeah. I love that one, too. It was the day the Prairie Dogs lost the big game. Riley missed the winning shot. She wanted to quit. That's right. Devo. Sorry. I went sad again, didn't I? We can keep working on that when we get back, okay? That's what you do. Time and place. But that's what makes that memory so happy. Absolutely. People forget, I think, that sometimes the amount of happiness you feel is because of the correlation to the sadness you felt for that or other things or related things, whatever. Contrast creates definition. You can't be happy all the time. You would just be. Correct. Wouldn't even know you were happy. Anymore. That's a good way to put it. Uh huh. Smooth criminal. Hey, I'm just stealing your credit card. Oh, and you wow. did not notice. Wow. Alrighty then. That's uh, good times. Good one, mom. Honesty, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, fuck off, it's a flying train, really? <laughs> Come on. I guess the plus side here is her train of thought has been derailed, so. She lost her train of thought. She's like, wait, what was I doing? Yeah, literally. It's like when you walk through a doorway and just forget what you were doing. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Okay, nice. Good work, guys. Okay, yeah. Good hustle, everybody. Saviors. And now she's incapable of thinking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just goes completely brain dead. <laughs> Are we really doing this? We have no core memories. Let's get back to Minnesota and make more work. If we hurry, we can still stop her. Family Island, let's go. Last one. It's a reasonable thought process. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> it's too dangerous. We won't make it in time. Oh, yeah, no way. That's right. Oh, because that's crumbling too. Oh, yeah. She's about to run away. Yeah, true story. That's our only way back. Oh, oh shit. shit. Okay, try the tube. Yeah. A recall tube! We can get recall! You could totally recall. Yeah. <laughs> See you after school, monkey. We love you! Oh, I'm so sad that they remade that into a pile of garbage with Colin Farrell. I don't know, it barely exists in my memories. You know, it's just so whatever. Yeah, you know, I saw it and I was like, you took all the good parts out and just left the basic idea. <laughs> Oh, you're really gonna ditch like that? If you get in here, 
Your memories will get sad. Time and place. Just go after. Yeah, just go one after the other. Throw them first and then go together. Exactly. I'm sorry. Riley needs to be happy. Oh, wow. I mean, yes, but... Yeah, but like, damn. She also does need sadness. Yeah. Very important. She's just gonna be that bitch. <laughs> Yeah, see? Oh, shit. That's what you get. Yeah. Bad plan. Okay. Sadness, it is now up to you. Yeah. It uh, completely explains depression. Yeah. Also, that was a joke. No one get touchy about that because I have suffered depression for most of my life. So I'm allowed to make these jokes. Yeah. Talking about your own experiences and shit. Exactly. Yeah. Oof. Oh. <gasps> Oh, wow, that's quick. Yeah. Fast acting. Does it affect her, though? I don't remember. I'm like, how do you forget an emotion? Joy? Yeah. I don't think you could. We're stuck down here. Yeah. Hey, some of these things are important. You can't put a happy spin on that. And now Joy feels sadness. How interesting. Yeah. To be fair, there is blue in her, you know, color design. Yeah, absolutely. I do appreciate that, that it's kind of like joy cannot exist without a bit of sadness, but sadness can exist without any joy. That is an interesting thought process, yeah. Do you remember? She used to stick her tongue out. She was coloring. I could listen to her stories all day. She has. Yeah. I just wanted Riley to be happy. Yeah, us too, buddy. Yeah, things, things get complicated, though. <laughs> She's just like, God, fuck off, sadness. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, she's not fading. I think she'd just be stuck. Kind of in limbo. Yeah, see, that's the thing. It started off sad. Mm. Marley missed the winning charge. She fell off. Hey, game winners are tough. Mm. You can't hit them all. And I think it's an important memory to have. Yeah, shows that it's not the end of the world. As a healthy human being, you want to remember that shit to, like, balance yourself out. As a successful athlete, you want to forget that shit so you just keep going for it. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, it's an interesting dichotomy, but, like, generally speaking, hitting big shots kind of requires you forgetting the shots you missed. Yeah. Definitely hear what you're saying about the difference between that and being a healthy human being, because I would say failure is a necessity for success. Absolutely. Mom and dad, team, they came to help. Oh, now she's getting it. Because of sadness. That's true. You're getting it. We have to get back up there. Joy was stuck down here. We might as well be on another planet. No. Just because it's difficult doesn't make it impossible. Exactly. Another planet. Or a moon. Who's your friend who likes to play? What you were saying earlier about the connection of joy and sadness, that her light is blue. His rocket makes you yell hooray. Yeah, you're right. The little outer. You know what I mean? Who's the best in every way and wants to see? There you go. Got to use that creativity. Imagination. Hop in. Who's your friend who likes to play? Who's your friend who likes to play? Who's your friend You've got enough. Keep going. You can do this. Uh, pretty far off. Oh shit. What does happiness and an imaginary friend weigh? Come on! I am curious. <laughs> oh shit. Come on, Joy, one more time. Mm. Got a feeling about this one. No, this is fucking tragic. Yeah. The load will be lighter because he disappears along the way. He jumps off. Oh no, he just bails. Yeah, I get it. You got this, kid. You can do it. We're gonna make it! Not we. Gotta love the optimism. Yeah. We did it! Bing bong? Yeah. You made it! Sacrifice. Yeah, this, this is just so sad. Go save Riley! Yeah. Take her to the moon for me, okay? God. Yeah. This is so dark. <sighs> hey, the reality of emotions, right? Yeah. It's inner workings of the mind. I'll try. Bing bong. Man, they just, they did my man bing bong so dirty. <laughs> Kicked to the curb, was a homeless. I promise. And then she just dies. This was Pixar going for the tear jerk moment, you know? Oh, for sure. I was just like, hey, Stannis is important, remember guys? <laughs> We're home. I'll call her cell. It's mom, she's on to us. <laughs> what do we do? My bad, we keep going. Yeah, boy. Oh, goodbye family island. Yeah. 
Oh no, still kind of there. Yeah. Just falling apart. Yeah. If I were sadness, where would I be? The same place you left her? Yeah. Everything is awful and my legs don't work. <laughs> and you have to drag me around while I touch. Yeah. Hey, as a thought, follow the blue balls. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> no. As soon as I said it. The fact that you didn't mean it somehow makes it worse. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's mom again. He should run away. Let's get this idea out of her head. Double backing on it now. Apparently. Hey, why, why are you running? Why are you running? She feels like she ruins everything. Oh, I get it. Riley's better off without me! Joy has spent literally this entire movie making her feel like shit about herself. <laughs> like she has no use. Your husband was blown away by an elephant. Was he with anyone? There she is! Hey! <laughs> Double homicide. Yeah, it is fucked up, man. Oh, I only make everything worse! Again, not true. I mean, she's kind of like, I just murdered somebody. I've led to the death of so many. <laughs> You know, I just realized, you know, how many fantastic, amazing songs, movies, stories have been created by sadness? Yeah, exactly. You gotta have a spectrum of emotions. Oh, great! No, 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 no! What is this? Also, who the mm. fuck let this child get a ticket for this bus? America. Mm. How do we stop it? Make her feel scared! Nothing's working, what? Let me try! Hey, you broke it! Yeah, I do like that it's like she's going completely numb. Yeah, absolutely. I like the analogy. Uh, guys, oh. we can't make Riley feel anything. What have we done? That's a good question. Did did you mean what you said before? I would die for Riley. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, haircut. Time to prove it. Oh my god. <laughs> I would die for Riley. I would die for Riley. Would... Okay, <laughs> yeah. A sack full of sad boys. You could say it's a sad sack. <laughs> hey, he's on a roll today. Hey. <laughs> Hey, fucking, that's it! I fold! I fold. The house of cards, what the shit? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a plan. I like it. Hope you have enough. <laughs> Guys, remember? You said you would die for her. Oh, then they're going to. Oh, yeah. This is crazy. No, no, no. Joy, be positive. I am positive this is crazy! <laughs> Hang on, if sadness can fly on a cloud, how come you can't? Yeah, I know, right? This is more fun. True. What's up? See? Joy gives you wings. I wish Joy was here. <laughs> here we are to save the day. <laughs> Shit. Stand back. Oh, that's... <laughs> Oh, no. That worked. Well, what would you do if you're so smart? I tell you, but you're too dumb to understand. Ah, uh, here we go. Nice. Of course your tiny brain is confused. Sorry you don't speak moron as well as you. Smart. Good plan. Oh, well, let me try. <laughs> <laughs> Good, Brian. Love it. Things are really messed up. Everything's gone to shit. Yeah, pretty much. When the one useless person on the team leaves for a little while. <laughs> yeah. Joy, you gotta fix this. Sadness, it's up to you. Sadness. Sadness. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is true. She gotta confront it. I can't, Joy. Yes, you can. Riley needs you. This is the time. When the fuck else do you feel sad, you know? Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you just become the epitome of that dog meme. This is fine. <laughs> yeah, totally. There we go. She's like, hang on, this is a bad plan. Realize just how dumb it was. Yeah. Stop! I want to get off! There you go, kid. Again, this is just the most chill bus driver ever. Yeah. Let <laughs> an underage girl on with no supervision, stop the bus in the middle of a road. Sure. He's like, yeah, whatever, man. Our teacher hasn't even seen Riley all day. What? Riley! Riley. There you are. Thank oh, goodness. we were worried sick. How did the school not call them? That's what my school would do if he didn't show up. First thing they'd do. True story. Well, again, plenty of terrible school systems that just, they're overworked. Yeah. Overwhelmed. Underfunded. It is absolutely not the fault of most of the people people working there. I'd say some of the people working there kind of suck, but not all. Oh, absolutely. And look, I don't live in America. I've not been to those schools myself, so I can only speak from what I've heard. Yeah, no, I'm just talking from the experience of like researching different schooling systems in different countries to see how things work, you know? Exactly. Yeah, nah, here we go. Mm. Yeah, man, they are sad memories now. I mean, I'd like to think of them as mixed memories, you know what I mean? There's sadness around them, but they don't have to be entirely. Yeah, hold on, I'm pretty sure they start getting mixed. Yeah, I would assume. There you go, hon. Let it all out. <laughs> Time to confront your emotions. Or confront your reality, I guess. Reality of your emotions. I know you don't want me to. 
but I miss home. You need me to be happy, but yeah, there it is. I want my old friends, hockey team. Please don't be mad. Of course not, sweetie. We're not mad. I miss Minnesota too. I miss the woods and we took hikes and the backyard where you used to play. Yeah, everybody goes through it. Absolutely, and I appreciate that from what little we've seen of the parents, they're realistic. They're good quality. Oh, they miss things, but they're not perfect in any way. Yeah, it happens. You know, you get so used to being able to deal with stuff yourself, you forget that other people might not be as capable as you because they're younger, less experienced. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all people are people, and the parents are just human beings trying to get through it. Yeah, they've got their own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they do love their daughter. Exactly. And there you go. There's a mixed memory. Absolutely. Happy and sad. Teamwork, guys. Teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> hey. And there we go. New and improved. Rebuilt. And it's got the Golden Gate Bridge in it now. Like that. Yeah, I saw that. Seriously, if someone could explain why it's called the Golden Gate Bridge when it's red. Oh, yeah, I, I gotta know. Did it used to have golden gates? Too many people crashed into them. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Fully mixed emotions. Hey, I'm liking this new view. Friendship Island. Finally open that friendly argument section. Friendly argument section. I like tragic vampire romance island. Vampire romance? Yeah, hell no. Don't keep that as a core memory. Your new expanded console is up. Hey, advanced. There's room for all of them. Yep. Oh, oh. whoops, did I just do that? Hey, what's <laughs> I have access to the entire curse word library. <laughs> this new console is done. Uh, Sorry. Brilliant. Nice. That's hilarious. You get out there, you be aggressive. Yeah, fantastic. You know, you guys don't have to come to every game. <laughs> Go, fuck Go, Riley! Oh. Okay. oh my god. Guys, tone it down a touch. Don't be like classic no. sports parents, because um that can go wrong. Just a bit too supportive. Yeah. She loved the face painting. And don't be so supportive that you punch out the ref. That's all I'm saying. Oh, yeah. What are you going to do? I thought this was America. Isn't this America? Best idea he's had in a while. Just in case. Yeah. Fair enough. Oh. Hey. Oh, this is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> so accurate. Oh. Okay. Hilarious. Yep. Comedy goals. I'm with you, buddy. Yeah. Or was, you know, back then. <laughs> We've been there. You ready? Yeah. Let's play some hockey. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Get their teeth. We've been through a lot lately, that's for sure. But we still love our girl. She has great new friends. Things couldn't be better. Well, I mean, things could be better, but... After all, Riley's 12 now. What could happen? Oh, my God. Good to accept the reality of things are great. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Who can tell me what year San Francisco was founded? Jordan! Just showing other people's ones. How much more of this? Oh. Five months, two weeks, yeah. and four days. I appreciate this. Then it's off to the Bahamas with you know who. Wait. Go. Oh my god. <laughs> the same guy. <laughs> Oh, I love it. Consistent thirst trap. It's like the in-universe version of um, Fabio or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I know, totally. Oh, I like this one. We're a total fraud. Yep. Do you think they can see through us? Of course not. Being cool is so exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the birthday girl? Nice. Oh. Hey! Hello? Oh. oh. Poor guy. Okay. Six years of drama school for this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 this is fine. We just need to go to our happy place. Triple them gun. <laughs> That's fantastic. <laughs> that's pretty classic. See, that's why dogs are so happy. They're all cohesive. Yeah. Oh, this was great. <laughs> Not on the job. That makes sense. <laughs> Walking over shit randomly. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's quality. Accurate. Gotta love it. Oh, Amy Poehler was Joy. Oh, Joy was Amy Poehler. Okay. That's right. That makes sense. Yeah. That's cool. How'd you feel about this one? Okay, better than I remembered. With hindsight, being able to see more of the details and appreciate mm. them, better. Definitely better. If going on Friendsfire, what would you rate this? Actually, Ooh. more importantly, I'm going to bring up our Friendsfire ratings on the screen. Ah, very clever. Big brain yeah, yeah, thoughts. Yeah. I think I would give it a seven. Solid seven. It's not in my top five. 
five or anything, but yeah, it's good. I'm going to give it an eight. I will say that hmm. I do have a tendency to go for eight <laughs> pretty often. It's a good number. <laughs> it's a solid number. I like the nuance of this movie, you know what I mean? No, it is definitely nice. And I think that's kind of its whole it's... angle. I think I get a little too caught up on the like cogs and gears of it where I'm like, wait, hold on a second. So if all of this happened in Riley's brain, but this was all necessary for her personal development, does a big disaster like this where joy and sadness get kicked out of the thing happen every time she has a major change in her life? What is the deal? And I kind of overthink those parts. It'd be interesting to see a sequel to this with her being, you know, like 17 or something. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Pixar's very deliberately not going for sequels for the foreseeable future. Uh, they made a full statement about it. Okay, I can respect it. Yeah, no, same. Especially mm. because, I don't mm. know, I found it just myself. Their sequels are not bad, but just they're never as good as the original ones. So I'm like, give us new ideas, guys. That's what you do. It's definitely hard to get a good quality sequel, yes. make it work. I can understand that. I think often when sequels do work, it's partly because there were plans to be that way. Not always, obviously. Exactly, yeah. Deliberately make the first one as a springboard to go into the second one. But when you just tack it on, it can kind of get awkward. Yeah, obviously there are exceptions. Like, I don't think Terminator 2 was planned ahead of time. And that's no, like one of the not. greatest sequels of all time. But. Yeah, this was good. And I, you're right. I think it's all about more than nuances, more than messages, how we cope with emotions, how we process mm. them, the necessity of negative emotions in helping us to grow and change. The way it makes you think. Exactly, yeah. And I really appreciate it. Yeah, I feel like this was almost more appreciated by adults because they could understand the full depth of it. Absolutely. But I think it's something that you should see mm. as a kid now for those kids out there who have the opportunity and then re-watch it again, like late teens, early 20s, just to like see how you review it. I do like those kind of stories where it's like, I feel like this would be one where every time you watch it again, you see a little more than you did last time. Yeah, exactly. Or you see it in a new light, you know, with new experiences to compare it to. They're like, oh yeah. Exactly. You know? Good quality stuff. Not sure what we're doing next, but you know, until we get there, you've been with Sam. Steph. We're the movie buds. buds.